Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, my name is Ashton and I make faith videos here on YouTube. And I also occasionally vlog my life. Um, so as you can see in the title of this video, um, we are taking another solo trip to Boston, Massachusetts. So really excited about that. Today is Monday, April 4th. Um, it is 9.34. Um, so I am getting ready to go get a massage. Um, and an adjustment at my chiropractor. Um, and then after that, I have to run some errands. And then I'll be dropping my fur baby off to my brother. At noon. And then I'll be packing all my stuff up like in my car and then I will be getting on the highway. Um, I don't have to be at the airport until five, but the airport is two hours away. And then my friend and I are going to grab lunch um, because he lives in the same city as the airport. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited. It's my first time going to Boston. Um, I don't know if I've mentioned this on my channel, but I'm trying to see all 50 states. Um, before I turn 30 um, and I'm 24 now I turned 25 this year so I have a long ways to go um, so hopefully we can start racking them up we'll see um, so yeah super excited to go to Boston um, last year I went to New Orleans solo and I also went to Dallas solo um, and I do have vlogs on my channel um, about those two trips so I will link those in the cards above um, but yeah I am going to get ready to head out for my massage um, and I will catch back up with you guys a little bit all right you guys I just had the best massage of my life not the best massage of my life but a very good massage great adjustment y'all i just love my massage therapist we be in there chopping it up for real for real um but now i am at the post office um because i have to return this fashion nova order um and then I am going to go home. I need to clean out my car real quick. Um, and then get my fur baby stuff together so that um, I can run these next couple of errands. I need to get some food because I'm starving. And then I'm going to drop her off at my brother's house. Um, so yeah, I will probably catch back up with you guys after I do all of that. And we are getting ready to get on the highway. All right, guys, so it is 1.14 and I'm getting ready to get on the highway. Um, thankfully, the weather is clearing up, so it's no longer raining, um, which is great. Um, I did end up going and putting a little bit of um, foundation on and brows just because my skin is has been looking crazy a little bit. Um, so I did do that. So my luggage is back there. Um, I texted my friend and I'm like, hey, I'm about to be on my way. Um, I have a taste for tacos. And he was like, that's crazy because I wanted Mexican too. Um, so we're going to go to this place that's close to the airport. Um, and yeah, so I will check back in with you guys when we are grabbing some food. Abraham's here, but he went to go get his um, camera because um, I told him to vlog. Um, I'll put the link to his channel below. He does like trading videos and stuff like that. So if you're interested in making some money, subscribe to his channel. Thank you. Do you want to wait till he gets back? Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. And then both of these sauces are the same. We only have the one time. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Oh, just let me know when you guys are ready. Okay. So yeah, it is 3.53. I'm hungry. I gotta lay low on the beans because 
I don't want to be on a plane to eat. But yeah, I'll show y'all him when he gets here. Abraham, say hello. What's up, y'all? What's up? Who are you? What's your name? Abe Shaw. Abraham Shaw. Yeah, it's like, oh, no. Abraham. Here she go. Well, everybody else can call him Abe. Yeah. I'm calling him Abraham because that's his name. She's the only one that called me that, and I don't know why. Because that's the name your mama gave me. Oh. Why would I call you anything else? Call me Abe. Okay. No, I'll call you Abraham. So, yeah. hotel um, and yeah it's not the best hotel I've ever stayed in um, it's probably certainly not the worst hotel in the area um, the restaurant which has really great reviews is temporarily closed so that's great especially because I'm starving um, I guess a cool thing about this room is that it features, or about like the hotel in general, is that it features different art. Um, and I really hate hotels that have like adjoining rooms or whatever it's called. I just put that bench there. Um, but yeah, so everything seems, um, Everything is clean, um, clean, uh, but yeah, um, so I almost missed my flight and I had to literally run, not I didn't run because your girl don't run, but I had to speed walk. So I was at the wrong um, terminal. By the time that I realized I was at the wrong terminal, it was like 20 minutes until my flight started boarding. Um, so by the time my flight started boarding, I had just gotten to the right terminal. I needed to go through security again um, and then my gate was literally, <coughs> bless me, out of 76 gates, my gate was like 75. So I had to literally go all the way to the end of the terminal. And um, when I got there, there were two girls having trouble with their boarding pass. And I'm like, man, that was nothing but God. But y'all, I was literally dripping sweat, makeup, edge control, just dripping when I got in my seat. Um, so yeah, and then the dude sitting next to me, he and his girlfriend or wife or whoever she was, wanted to sit next to each other. So the flight attendants ended up moving some stuff around and I ended up getting 
a whole world to myself so that was great even with all of the stress and i feel like there were just so many things like so many revelations that i had throughout this whole process and the flight and stuff like that um so i'm probably gonna talk about them i don't know maybe tomorrow in the morning or something maybe i'll do like a get ready with me but yeah so now i'm about to see what food is around here that i can order um because i haven't on the drive in i didn't really see too many restaurants um so yeah i was kind of sad because the airbnb that i really wanted um was only available for two of the three nights um and i just didn't want to be moving around and then the other hotels were just i'm not trying to pay a thousand dollars for three nights um yeah because all i would be doing is sitting in the hotel <laughs> i don't make money like that i work in youth ministry so yep like i said i'm about to find me some food take a shower and call it a night um so depending on what food i get maybe i'll show you guys if not then i will talk to you guys in the morning good morning it is still morning because it is 11 47. um i am finally up and ready i <clears throat> slept in today i got me some good rest i was tired after yesterday if y'all could have seen me sprinting through the airport feet walking through the airport baby my feet was on fire leg was on fire <sighs> chest felt like it's gonna jump out of my chest that was a workout so yeah um today we are getting ready to explore a little bit unfortunately i think that this is the only day that i'm going to be able to explore um because tomorrow it's supposed to be raining all day my tour guide for my food tour of Little Italy tomorrow just texted me and said that it's canceled um, because of the weather. So that sucks. Um, right now it's beautiful and sunny and clear skies. So I guess we're going to do as much as we can today and then maybe tomorrow will just be a chill day. I have some books I want to read, um, some YouTube videos I want to catch up on and stuff like that. So maybe it'll just be some time of relaxation which you know isn't bad as well i hope you guys could hear me in this clip because the tv was on but yeah so i am getting ready to get some breakfast i don't know about you guys but even when i get up late like i feel like i always have to have breakfast so there's a coffee shop um that's like a seven minute walk so we're gonna walk um and then we'll probably come back to the hotel and catch an uber um so i the whole time i'm staying at is in austin um and so i want to go to boston y'all the neighborhoods in different cities are so confusing to me but so um, I want to go to Fenuel, Fenuel Hall Marketplace um, and let's just kind of walk around over there and then I might go to um, Harvard's campus or whatever. I don't know, is that in Cambridge? Maybe. I don't know, but we're going to figure it out. But first, I need some food and I definitely need some coffee. So let's go get that.
all right guys so i am back to my hotel y'all i am all this working out i'm out of breath um so i walked to the coffee shop and baby this sweater or the sun i don't know but your girl was sweating by the time that she got there um and then when i got back it was people getting on the elevator so i just took the stairs that's why i'm breathing hard but um yeah so had a bagel it was the sunrise bagel on everything so it was bacon egg and cheese on everything bagel baby delicious um and then i had an iced vanilla coffee that was okay um so now i really want to enjoy the day so i'm gonna try to book a city pass um and see if like there are some cruise harbor cruises and stuff available today um so that i can enjoy the weather um i also have to do some work really quickly hopefully it won't take me but like five minutes to get it done um i know i shouldn't be but i need to make sure that the team has everything that they need for this week so i'm just gonna do some quick work i'm gonna buy this pass hopefully i can get out and do some things today um because the weather is beautiful and i'm not trying to waste a trip so yeah let's see what i can find all right guys so i ended up getting the city pass so we are it is 1 and we're getting ready to call an uber uh, because first up we're going on a hour-long historic harbor cruise um and then after that we're gonna go to the new england aquarium um and then after that we'll probably walk around um like the newell whatever it's called hall the little marketplace and then I think the plan is to come back here, change, and then find a nice restaurant to go to dinner. And then we'll come back, have ourselves a great night. And then tomorrow we'll probably be stuck in the room all day. So um, let's go. I'll probably be recording on my phone. I don't know. I have to check and see if I can like bring my camera in, like the aquarium and stuff. Um, but we'll see.
hey guys so i have made it back to the hotel it is it is 5 45 um so as you guys saw i went on the harbor cruise then i went to the aquarium then i went to um the little market place like Quincy Market and whatever for new for Neil Hall, whatever it's called. Walked around there. I got a green smoothie because I just wasn't feeling that well, even when I was walking around the aquarium. And then um, even walking around there, I just wasn't feeling good. Um, and so I got a green smoothie. I paid nine dollars for that smoothie, and to be honest, it tasted like. Um, one of those boat ho boat house farms green smoothies, and I feel like he just poured that in a blender with some ice and gave me a smoothie. But he added a slice of pineapple that was cute. So whatever. Um, what else? Um, I went into Sephora, um, and I sprayed the Kaali perfume, the vanilla it smells so good and also um uh vanilla woods mm. and i was gonna get the roller balls or like the spray travel spray of those but sephora is having like it's sale right now so i'm just gonna wait and get that probably this weekend um and yeah i wanted to go out to eat and grab some food but my phone was only on like 18 percent and so um i want to be able to like sit down and enjoy my dinner and not feel rushed and maybe like watch a youtube video or something you know so i didn't want to be out um with my phone dying that's just I don't feel comfortable doing that especially when traveling alone so i decided to come back to the hotel i was tired anyway and just wanted to lay down for a second so i'm gonna charge my phone and while i do that i'm gonna try to find somewhere to eat dinner um because i have no idea and then once i figure that out i will probably freshen up a little bit and then get changed um and then go to dinner um so yeah it was a pretty good day i enjoyed it i didn't get to go to like harvard's campus or anything like that um and i wish i could go tomorrow but you know it is what it is um i definitely have not seen all of boston i haven't like gotten to try like all of the foods and stuff um because like i said earlier my tour for tomorrow got canceled so, yeah, I wish I had all the money in the world and I would just extend my trip, but baby girl don't got it like that. So, we gotta make do what it do, and I'm sure there's, God has a reason for all this, and I just already know that tomorrow, probably I'll just be spending time with him. Um, yeah, which I don't do a lot of these days. Um... And I'll, maybe I'll talk about that in like a get ready with me tomorrow or something. Just the woes, I guess, of being in ministry full time. Um, and what it can do to your personal relationship with God. Yeah, let's talk about that um, tomorrow morning. So yeah, like I said, I'm about to lay down, let my phone charge, and find where I want to go eat. All right, so change of plans. I feel like I do this every vlog. Again, breathing hard because I just ran up the stairs. But yeah, Uber Eats. Not going to dinner again because I'm tired. I don't feel like I'm dressed. Once I lay down in this bed, like, there is nothing else that I want to do. So, I'm about to eat my food, catch up on some YouTube, sorry. Eat my food, catch up on some YouTube videos, probably work on this vlog a little bit, and 
yeah let me show you guys what i got Some truffle fries, which pretty good, warm. So it's already better than yesterday. Five dollars off an online order. Maybe I'll be back tomorrow. Got a chocolate chip cookie. And then yes I ordered a grilled cheese on Uber Eats it is a bacon something and it looks great except for all of that at the bottom but yeah so I'm gonna eat this tomorrow I absolutely where's my phone tomorrow I absolutely have to um get some seafood because I haven't had seafood not once yet being here last night I have wings and fries today I'm eating grilled cheese so I definitely have to get seafood tomorrow um I checked the weather and it's supposed to rain by like 5 p it's supposed to rain until 5 p.m. So I'm probably not going to leave the hotel until then and I'm going to go out to dinner um, tomorrow at 5. And that will just be the last thing that I do um, before I head to the airport. I think my flight leaves at seven let me check delta delta <clears throat> no my flight actually leaves at nine so Probably be at the airport around seven, which is not horrible. So yeah, just chilling for the rest of the night, and I will talk to you guys in the morning.